Hey guys, just thought I would uh, share a little bit. I'm standing out here in the backyard looking at the uh, at the building and uh, we've had some pretty good wind going on all day. I'm gonna run down and uh, make a quick video and we got a thousand watts of uh, solar and we've got a, a thousand watt uh, hurricane wind turbine up there. That's the uh, white lightning vector and uh, We'll go down and uh, take a look at the uh, culmination of the day. She's been putting out good power. We've been working in the building most of the day and have not had an issue with uh, draining the batteries. When I left, they were at 100% state of charge. So I'll shoot a vid and, uh, and get it over to you. Hurricane wind power. Hey, I just wanted to share with everybody what was uh, happening here uh, at the building. We've been working inside uh, most of the day and all the lights have uh, been on and uh, <clears throat> we're still at a 99% state of charge and as you can see I'm pulling about 41 amps DC at 24 volts, 43 amps uh, in order to run the lights and everything and if we go back over to uh, uh, what we're showing on our load, so at 120 volts, we're pulling about 8 amps uh, with these lights running. And we've been doing this uh, most of the day. I would say been out here since, oh, around 11 a.m. And it's coming up on 7 p.m. and I'm getting ready to head back. But I thought I would uh, take a moment to uh, run through this and show you. Uh, we've got the uh, Midnight Solar app up. And uh, you can see that the uh, uh, PV is kind of waning as uh, we're still putting out uh, 30 volts on the PV uh, all day long. It's made about uh, 3 kW. And uh, if we run over to the turbine, you can see that the uh, the wind has been blowing and uh, we got about 135 volts right now. We've made 8.4 uh, kilowatt hours today. And uh, she's been fluctuating between 800 and 1200 uh, watts uh, most of the day. And as you can see, uh, the, it's keeping up there, the 34 amps, 37 amps. Uh, so <clears throat> the battery uh, state of charge has been doing its thing, staying uh, nice and uh, happy at uh, 99 to 100% all day long. Uh, we'll go over to the data. So yeah, we've made 8.4 uh, kilowatt hours today. And just jump back over to the PV real quick and look at the data on it. And yep, three kilowatt hours, and exit out of that. You can see the uh, the two 8.5 kW on the turbine and three on the PV. And right now it's showing us yeah 743 watts it's making. So the uh, <coughs> reason I'm doing the computer on the doorstep is inside this building it's like a faraday cage and uh, i lose my internet connection once i'm inside the building but i'll take you over to the cabinet um, you can see there's our uh, thousand watts of solar and uh, the sun is waning on us and uh, up there the uh, the wind is continuing to blow and our lightning is doing its thing inside the cabinet uh, the midnight clipper is Fans are running, and we've got some warm air coming out of the top, so uh, that tells me that uh, the uh, uh, pulse width modulation is happening as it's going through. And run up here to the, this is the turbine controller, and you can see what it's doing. We've got the, uh, there's the aux 2 kicking in, so yeah, it's uh, sending the pulse back to the turbine to slow it down just a little bit 43 amps uh, at 165 volts and you can see the uh, 
1.5 kilowatt hours. Uh, wind is uh, fluctuating between 17 and 20 miles an hour. Uh, we just uh, put that in recently, so we can kind of keep an eye on that. And uh, over here on the solar controller, uh, there's our 4.9 amps from our sun. We've got our uh, three kilowatt hours for today. And everything's in float. The batteries are, are nicely, nicely charged. And uh, the clipper's doing its thing. Really glad that we have that. And uh, yeah, we could uh, make bread up there. You gotta believe in the wind and you gotta believe in the solar. We're off grid here and uh, haven't had a problem. Have a good one, y'all. Okay, well, it is just about, according to the computer, 8.30 p.m. today. And I'm getting ready to uh, prep myself for tomorrow, but I wanted to check the local app. And as you can see, the turbine has produced about 9.5 kilowatt hours today and the PV at 3.1 kilowatt hours. Uh, of course, it's dark now, so we don't have any uh, sun and the wind has died down quite a bit. So we're, as you can see, about 86 watts. Uh, state of charge on the batteries uh, when I left was at 99%, so I'm sure it won't be long, and yeah, it is in float. It won't be long, and uh, it'll be back up at 100. Uh, while I'm in here at 8.30, let's just go ahead and take a peek. This is what I was really interested in. The energy on this only goes up to 10. I'm kind of interested to see what happens when we go above uh, 10 kilowatt hours, whether it'll continue on down and peg or whether this... Uh, field will change. Um, never really looked at it. Um, but you can see we've got about 40 volts coming in. As I say, the wind died down quite a bit. 69, 70 watts of power. Uh, batteries at 24, 7. And we're just throwing four amps at it right now. So kind of interesting. Uh, come on down to the data. And yeah, 9.5 kilowatt hours, and she's doing her thing. Um, back over to the PV. Yeah, same thing here. It only goes up to 10, and we're at 3.1. Uh, no sun, input voltage less than, and so yeah, I would expect that battery voltage to come up to uh, at least. 26 volts and it won't be long before that happens I'm sure but uh, I'll try to check back in at this around uh, 1130 or so uh, and uh, it would really be nice to see what happens when we get above uh, 10 kilowatt hours on the app all right talk to you later hurricane wind power Well, there you have it, 11.30 p.m. on the 29th, the turbine has put out 10 kilowatts today, and as you can see, we haven't gone above the 10 kilowatts which is kind of what I wanted to see what would happen once it did as we're all the way at the top of the 10. And I don't think in the next half hour it's going to make it to 10.5 or it might make 10.1. But 
still making power. And over on the uh, PV side, of course, we're resting 3.1. Of course, there's no sunlight at 11.30 at night. So, there you have it. Hurricane, white lightning, vector 2.0. And today has put out 10 kilowatts since we started. And we're still going strong. Amazing. Hurricane wind power.